Well, hello again. It's your favorite guy, John. Hey. Seems like my life been really changing on me. I know some niggas out here hating on me. Hey, I see the bitches how they changing on me. I know some niggas out here snaking on me. Hey, see like my. Like, nigga, what the fuck is wrong with you today? Nothing. I'm just happy. You know what's fucking crap? I'm not even high. I ain't even smoked weed today. I ain't even drunk a beer. It is kind of early. But nigga, I still drink a beer, but I ain't drunk one yet. So it's like I'm normal. I'm just high for life right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm just high for life. I'm just picture perfect. I didn't even know the song was called Picture Perfect, but I'm just picture perfect right now. But look, we got a new artist alert. I heard this last song with him and he just did some shit with Jelly and the nigga was going in. So I was like, you know what? Let's go ahead and get the nigga on the channel. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead and get the Ritz. Ritz, you know, we had a, we had a club. I think it was called Ritz. I think we had a club called Club Ritz in goddamn uh, Midland. I think it was Midland, huh? Club Ritz? I think it was the Ritz. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to the Ritz in Midland. Well, that was a teen club back in the day in teen club. I was out to get it. You know what I'm saying? Whoo, teen club. Boy, you didn't want me around your daughter. In the teen club, ooh, I was finna get her. Anyways, uh, Picture Perfect with Ritz and uh, Tech Nine. You know what I'm saying? Everybody know who Tech Nine is. You can't just say Tech Nine. You gotta say Tech Nine. Like that nigga be saying. But anyway, it's Ritz. Picture Perfect, huh? Let's see what Picture Perfect's about. I can't even sit here and try to say what I think it's gonna be about because I don't know. Knuckles. But let's go ahead and get some motherfucking Ritz. Hold up. Open that. Cancel that. Right click that, new screen record that. It's in the right spizzot. Hit record and hit play twice. One, two. Oh, three. Picture perfect. Ritz. Take nine. You the guy for the BT cypher, right? I saw you one day, y'all played with gun players for me. Just sign with tech, with tell Wolf, what's up for me? I miss Ritz back in the slum days. My ex girlfriend said you hung us on place. Maybe the sun sweet. You remember that? Said you was cool till you got real drunk. Could just change it. Put someone's face to the wood in the bookcase. The TV stand, whatever was. Damn, I heard you like to talk in the tub. It's not cold. You know Ah, uh, nigga, why did you kill the shit? Okay, Ritz. Like that little suit you on there. Give me one of them suits. But, anyways. Nigga, you better not do no coke. Don't tell nobody that shit. Nigga, you don't do no coke. I don't. But anyways, bro, you coming in. I see why you with Tech Nine. The way you rap, you rap like fast like that, nigga. So I see why you signed with Tech Nine. That's what's up. Get your money, nigga. You are gonna be one of these rappers like Adam Calhoun and everybody else. They're not. They're like underground kind of like UGK type rappers. You know what I'm saying? Underground and shit because a lot of people ain't taking real music like this serious. They taking a hippity hobbity bullshit. Which nothing wrong against the youth. It's just some of the shit don't make no sense. It's all about drugs. It's about bullshit. What's up with the real deal? Holy filled music, guys. God darn it! I heard you cuss to the crowd for starting to mosh pit. What was that? The Nova and North Folk? I forgot. I told them my homies that you're dope. Uh. I like when you rap fast, more and going slower. I got a joint brother was told you don't smoke. What, uh. do? what with you? I tell you what, sure I don't. I don't want to get hot with somebody from not eating. They believe in every word that they heard. They say you make it up dirt like I'm not a normal person. Like I'm a let them talk to me a certain way. They mosh pit. Uh. It's cool in a certain place. This nigga, he called me. It's gonna be hard to fucking catch every goddamn one of the people. I'm like, did you catch that? Did you catch that? Did you catch it? You probably watched it 35,000 times. It's my first time. And I wanna fucking remind and remind and remind because I'm gonna fuck up my time and I'm gonna get my dimes took to another side. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if you caught that. Basically, I'm gonna get my, my, my money gonna go away, okay? I ain't gonna pay a lot on YouTube, but the little change I do get, I want to keep it. You know what I'm saying? I want to keep it. But Ritz keeps spitting shit. Keeps spitting. Uh, 
that nigga really killing it, bro. He's really spitting the game. It was hard to catch it with the suave and the, the soap shit, you know what I'm saying? And he says, little man gonna get a little soft, you know what I'm saying, like that. But a lot of shit is hard to catch, but I'm gonna roll ahead and just go ahead and go with the punches. <laughs> Nothing is picture perfect, man. Real talk. I wish shit could be picture perfect right now, but it ain't. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing gonna ever be picture perfect. Might be a picture, or it might be a perfect in that picture, but ain't gonna ever be picture perfect. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Uh, uh, never feel still, nigga. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to really catch these up. It's taking a little man. I'm trying to process all this shit fast. My mind, my motherfucking, my motors is running. I'm not high, like I said, so it's not coming to me clear. So my motherfucking motors is just running. Running and running and running. You ain't really know when I think I'm quick enough. They wanna go my way for the hunt to come sick as fuck. Speak up, I go to my tell ya. Sick as one nigga, what? Every fucking day I'ma tell ya. I ain't running with failures. They ain't never going back to drug paraphernalia. They held up. So all the nigga that shit must die. The haters really wanna see me in hell. I'm fried. Hell no. I'm fucking with a chunk of stupidity. Can you dig it up? What do you say? Got no validity. Cause we giving the most every day. Don't you admit to me that you're talking about a nigga with pay? These niggas is wild, bro. I would love to party with these niggas. I bet they parties just be wild as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Be I that bitch just wild and crazy. You know what I'm saying? I feel like niggas be in mosh pit and shit fuck with their music. I'll be scared to be in the mosh pit. I got a bad back and shit. Them niggas might fuck my back up and I might shoot a nigga. You know what I'm saying? I tried to put play. You heard me click. I couldn't do it. <laughs> uh. No place to hide. There's no place to hide. Cause the government's always got them watching. Niggas always got your phone tapped. Got everything tapped. Why y'all wanna know everything, goddamn me? What does it get y'all? Nothing! Shit. <laughs> Anybody got another verse? It's a whole minute left. Oh, I'm about to say. No, no. Real talk. That shit said, why do we still have to protest this? This real fucking talk. Why do we still have to protest about some shit? I don't know why I'm still jamming, but I still got the song, my beat stuck in my head. But I understand why we still got to protest about some shit that should have been done a long time ago. I wish it even been started a long time ago. You know what I'm saying? Like, this shit's dumb to me. Like, a lot of shit we're going through, it's dumb right now. I'm still jamming. Like, nigga, how you gonna be talking and jamming? Cause I'm just talking and jamming. Do me. <laughs> Real talk, fuck race tissue, hashtag together. Real talk, hashtag together. That's all I want, people. Damn, can we just be one? One, 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 one. Can we just be one? Can we just let everything go and move the fuck on? No, we can't. Because the elites and the higher powers doesn't want us to. So that's why we, as the people, have to fuck these niggas up. I said we gonna fuck them up. I really do. I ain't saying fuck the stores, I said them. Call them outside and whoop they ass. Whoever needs them. Got a big list. You wanna be on it? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but anyways, man. Real talk, I fuck with the song. Let me go ahead and finish this shit out real quick before I start talking. I need, I need that little jumpsuit too. Fuck that little jumpsuit. Brought a white man and a black man together and made a goddamn hit. C and T. But real talk, so look. I fucks with the song hard. I 
fucked the song real hard. Like I said, there's a lot going on there. It's kind of hard to process everything. So I can't speak on every single thing. But what I will speak on is that real talk, the racism shit and everything else would be... I mean, it shouldn't have ever started. It's just hard. It should never start it. Should have been dead a long time ago. Should never have started, like I said. But if it did start, which it did start, it should have been dead a long time ago. Because it's too much right now. Our youth are coming together. So it's like, where's the racism? It's the other older, fucking older people. I ain't gonna say older white people, it's just older people, period. Because everybody that's older is racist because they, oh, I ain't gonna say is racist, but seeing some type of form of racism because they were in that time of it. You know what I'm saying? If you have an old ass black man, he wouldn't want you to be with a white woman because of what he's seen in that time. You have an old ass white man, he wouldn't want you to be with a nigga because of what they seen at that time. But nowadays, we all come together. And now most of us, uh, some of us come together and make one, and then if you see what happens, the most beautiful people, most beautiful human beings in the world are black and white kids together. Asians every now and then get in there with the, you know, the mix, because like my niece and nephew, beautiful as hell. But I'm just saying, black and white kids would make the most beautiful race in the world. And it's sad because them two people can't just come together and make one. One. You know what I'm saying? You got elite saying this, you got... Us believing in this, you got elite saying we should believe in this, you got believing in this, and yes, you know, all types of crazy fuck shit that we need to just let go and move the fuck on, and then boom, the world will be a better place. You just hear birds chirping all the time, and just nigga, every time you walk, you just walk with just like just walking. You know what I'm saying? Like nigga, just loving life. Now, nigga, why you walk like that? Cause life's beautiful. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Nigga, start getting soft voices and shit. Life's beautiful. Don't have to raise my voice. But now we gotta be like, ah, oh, nigga, fuck you, fuck this, ah, ha, ah, ah. ha. It's done. It's done. Hashtag motherfucking no more racism.